Alright guys, once again I'm going to show you how to add a subscriber button to your videos on YouTube. Uh, it's also known as a branding mark or a watermark. I know I did go over this the other day and um, made a video, but there was one little detail that was left out. It wasn't that big of a deal, it's just kind of uh, some information that you might want to know. So this is kind of just an update on that. Um, so we'll get started. Okay, the first thing you want to do is make sure you're signed in and then go to my channel. Just like last time, I'll go over this kind of quick and then I'll go over it again at the end. That way, if you want to do it uh, step by step, we can do that. And after you go to my channel, you go to Video Manager, go to Channel, Branding, and then that won't be there. When you come to Branding, if you don't already have a watermark, you'll have this button here, Add a Watermark. You click that, and before you choose a file, unless you already have something saved that you want to use, you can go to Google and just Google uh, subscriber button and then you can choose uh, not videos you want to choose images and then pick whichever one you want this one's actually pretty cool I haven't uh, haven't seen that one yet um, cop uh, save image as and then save it as whatever you want I've already got that so we'll just uh, move on after you save that you want to go back to choose file and then just find wherever you saved your image to I'm gonna use this one here I like the bigger the square ones because these smaller ones like this the buttons so small in your in your video that it sometimes these are hard to see and if you use these bigger ones here it just kinda of stands out more and it's easier to get people's attention so I'm gonna use this one once you choose your file hit save and then here it shows that it's uploaded, but I always hit save again. It seems like it doesn't go until you hit it twice. And then here it will show that you have been uploaded and it's ready to go. So you can go back to your channel and pick one of your videos to check it. Yeah, I have mine set up so that after five seconds, it'll pop up down here. And then this is what I left out last time. Um, this is a link that actually takes you to your channel. A lot of people think that it's a subscriber link that brings you to the subscriber window like this link down here does it'll bring you to a different window um, but what I did leave out was right here when you hover over this you know if you if you're signed into your own channel or if you're on somebody's channel that you've already subscribed it doesn't really give you the button to subscribe it just brings you to their channel but say you're on somebody else's channel that you have not already subscribed to when you hover over that it actually gives you the subscribe button here this is just a little bit different from the regular subscriber window that you see when you click this button, for example. Or I guess it's a link. It's a link. Uh, you can make a link to bring up a window. It's different from that also. Um, but yes, this is what I left out. This actually shows up here. Um, so it is a little bit better than what we were thinking, whereas when you click the button, it brings you to their Let main, me ask you a main question. page. So um, that's what I wanted to add to this video like I said, just a little bit of information. It doesn't really change what you've already done. Um, it all works the same. That, you just might want to know that. Um, and then we'll go over this again here, step by step, if you haven't already got everything set up for yourself. Um, again, you know, you're signed in already. Go to my channel. We'll do this slow. I know I always like to pause things when I go over tutorials like this. But once you hit my channel, go to Video Manager. And once you've done that, hit Channel. And under Channel, it's under Branding. If that's not already there, you'll hit Add Watermark. You want to choose your file that you've saved. You can use anything. You can use any picture you want make a custom picture like for example I could use I could use my uh, logo here I really like this one because it stands out and then just hit save hit save again and that is it all right guys I hope this video helped you out um, if you're already subscribed you've probably seen this video and maybe this has helped you before um, if you're 
you search this and you know you're not already subscribed to me and this is new to you and it helped you out let me know let me know down in the comments um, or if you're having issues with it and you need help trying to figure something out also comment below I'll get on and I'll help you figure things out um, if you're not subscribed please hit the like button subscribe and um, and share if you know somebody else that uh, is looking to to do this on one of their videos share it with them and until next time guys good luck and have fun